For the billion people on our planet struggling to live on less than $2 a day, the majority are women living in rural areas. For these women and their families, one single asset can make all the difference, land. Without land, many women and their families struggle to find shelter, a place to grow food, and a source of income. When women's husband dies or they're abandoned, if they at that point lose their rights to land, then sometimes they lose everything. They lose their food security, they lose their income. Often women end up engaging in transactional sex, and that, of course, can increase the spread of HIV AIDS. In many countries, women and girls don't have rights to property. They are property. But there is a solution. Secure land rights give women the most basic and powerful asset to lift themselves and their families from poverty. Studies show that when women have secure rights to land, they spend the income from that land on their children's nutrition and on their education, particularly girls' education. Women are at the center of the family structure, so it's important that women are also at the center of development efforts. When you focus on women, the impacts don't just go to one woman. They go to her family, they go to her children, they go to her neighbors. The whole community really becomes stronger. RDI's work began in 1967, when founder Roy Prosterman was so concerned about the escalating war in Vietnam that he gave up his Wall Street law career to do something to help. In the midst of the war, Roy flew to Vietnam and helped draft a law that gave impoverished farmers land of their own, a small piece of security. I think I had a sense that this could perhaps be a, an historic uh, opportunity, that the land issue was really fundamental. Now, decades later, RDI has partnered with nearly 50 governments throughout the world to help get land rights to hundreds of millions of the world's poorest families. With legal empowerment, families can seize the opportunities to improve their lives. This year, these Lawyers for the Landless launched the world's first global center for women's land rights, a new initiative to focus on women and girls. RDI recognizes that laws and policies impact men and women differently, and that if we don't look at the changes in laws and policies through a gender lens, it's very possible that women are unintentionally harmed. Today, RDI is sought after by foreign governments, aid agencies, and NGOs to provide comparative experience, expertise, and clarity on land issues. RDI is unique because we work at the grassroots. We try to understand how laws and policies are impacting the poor and the women. But you have to get out in the villages. Uh, you have to ask farmers and other stakeholders. RDI is a bridge between those we seek to benefit and the governments who are in a position to establish the laws and policies that can provide those benefits. For many of us, a tenth of an acre doesn't sound like much, but for Ratna, it means the world. Ratna worked as a day laborer in a small village in India, making less than one dollar a day. Then Ratna's husband died and her whole life changed. All of Ratna's property was in her husband's name. She was left with nothing but the sari she was wearing. She had a small son to care for, but no home, no land where she could grow food, and no hope. But everything changed for Ratna when she received a microplot of land through a government program designed by RDI. With her microplot, Ratna built a home where she could care for her son and she planted vegetables to provide nutrition and income. Now, as a micro land owner, Ratna can send her son to school, giving him a new future. Most importantly, Ratna gained dignity and hope. Today, her son says she is his hero. Now that she's a landowner, she's not a victim. She's not a second-class citizen. She's somebody that's respected by both men and women in the village. She has a future she can provide for him. She's empowered. And that has a lasting impact on how he's going to see other women as he grows up. RDI's work is to ensure that families get what they need to lift themselves out of poverty. RDI is building a safer, more just world. 
and secure land rights are the foundation. On that foundation, we can build better nutrition and health, education, especially for girls, environmental stewardship, women's empowerment, and social stability. From very early days, I was impressed by the, the theme on which uh, Roy and his people were working. The Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation has very high standards when it comes to funding partnerships. RDI has leveraged our support to produce really dramatic results. More than a billion people around the world still do not have secure rights to land. The opportunity to help the world's poorest people is in our hands. Imagine how many millions of women could contribute, as Ratna does, to a better, safer world. Now you can help change lives and change our world. Join RDI's efforts and together we can create the kind of world we all want to live in.